So one of the main highlights of iOS 14 has to be picture in picture. You updated to iOS 14 and you realize the YouTube application doesn't support picture in picture, which is unfortunate. So you play the video, it just doesn't work, it doesn't pop out. I do have background play because I have YouTube Premium, but in this video I'm gonna show you guys how to get picture in picture on the YouTube application without downloading a third party application. You do it directly from the YouTube application here. So step number one, you want to make sure you have the Siri Shortcuts application. If you don't have it, I'm going to throw a link in the description. And don't worry, you don't have to pay a nickel. You don't have to pay a dime. Everything is completely free. And once you download that, you want to take it to the Settings application on your iPhone. Now once you download that, you want to take it to the Settings application. You go all the way down to Shortcuts. And you want to make sure Allow Untrusted Shortcuts. Now don't worry, everything is completely safe. Everything is completely free. So just make sure that box is on. Make sure that toggle is on, I should say. Step number three, I'm gonna throw this shortcut down below also. All the links will be in the description. You wanna add this shortcut. It's called YouTube PIP. PIP stands for picture in picture. You tap on get shortcut, and it's gonna show this. And you wanna just add that untrusted shortcut. And like I said, everything is safe. Everything is safe. Now I already added this shortcut, so I'm not gonna add it again. But yeah, you just tap on add and there you go it's just going to automatically add but i have it already and after that you want to download this application called scriptable this is free too as well you just want to take it to the youtube application and you want to tap on share and then you got to go all the way to the side you tap on more and then it's going to be on the bottom now there's a way you could move it up all the way to the top so you have fast access at all times so if you want it on the top you tap on edit actions and then there's a way where you can Add this to your top to your favorites so in this case I already have it so I'm gonna remove it and show you guys that it's right here you tap on plus and you put it to the top and now every time you tap on share and more you're gonna have YouTube PIP so once you tap on that it's gonna automatically open up the scribble or um, that application that we scriptable I should say and it's gonna just pop it into a picture in picture and of course you have additional features so you can you know, you have the uh, the fast motion, normal speeds, you can change the resolution, you can download the video too as well, which is pretty dope. And yeah, now you have picture in picture through the YouTube application. And this will work for all YouTube videos. So this is pretty impressive. Any YouTube video, and I could have picture in picture just like so. And picture in picture, boom. And it's gonna pop it right out. Wait for it to load. And there it is. Shout out to Mark the Geek. He got himself the Super Mario 3D All-Star. And yeah, and of course, you have all your picture-in-picture -picture options there. I, I don't think Google is going to even add picture-in-picture -picture because picture-in-picture -picture was first introduced on iOS 9 on the iPad Pros, but Google never updated the application to support it. And same thing with the iPhone. I don't think we ever will see it. So I hope this video helps. If it did, I appreciate it with a thumbs up. Make sure you guys subscribe. Help me reach to 100,000 subscribers. And also follow me on Instagram and on Twitter at Simply Pops. Hope you guys have a simple day. Stay safe out there. Deuces. Now, a couple of things I want to address before ending out the video officially. Um, YouTube has restrict picture in picture on the Safari web browser on your iOS device. So now Google is putting that towards a paywall now. So having picture in picture is a premium feature. So I don't know what Google is doing. Also, 4K support on iOS devices and Apple TV. It was supported on the beta, but then somehow, I guess Apple or Google, they pulled that out quick during the public release. So I'm not sure what that was about. So I don't know what Google is doing. And I wouldn't be surprised if Google actually put 4K as a premium uh, feature. So I'm not even sure what they're doing. But um, hey, I just hope that this tutorial helps. Um, there's no guarantee that it's going to last forever or if it's going to work forever. But... This is just something good to know, and yeah, Google, please add in picture in picture to the YouTube app, man. Please, it's on Android. Been enjoying the Galaxy Fold, which by the way, I'm recording this on my Galaxy Fold too, and I don't, I just don't get it, man. What makes iOS so different compared to Android when it comes down to the YouTube app? I have picture in picture on my Android. I don't have it on my iPhone. Uh, 4K should be here any day. I wouldn't be surprised if it's on iOS 14.1 or. It could be through a YouTube update where it could support 4K, but it was just supporting 4K on one of the betas. I forgot the exact number, but I just don't know what happened, man. And call me crazy, I don't think Google can even do that because think about it. 
that's an iOS feature. You can't put an iOS feature behind a paywall. Just it just doesn't make sense to me, man. Um, like why would I like for example, I'm not gonna put dark mode on the Instagram app because you have to pay money for Instagram Plus. Like it doesn't make sense. So I appreciate you guys watching the video all the way through, and yeah, stay safe out there. And yes, I know it's premium, not premium. Just you know, give me some slack. We, my side of the family, always say premium. I know it's premium.